Hi, good day. This is Paul from Solace, and today I'm going to be speaking about a very common, um, important setting to understand on um, the Solace PV inverter. Uh, here we've got a 10 kilowatt inverter, and we're going to um, learn how to derate the inverter. So essentially, if your AC side, or your AC system on your PV inverter is too small for this 10 kilowatt inverter, for example, you can essentially derate this inverter by changing a few settings to make it limit at 8 kilowatts. Okay, here we've got the um, default, I often call it the home screen of the, of the inverters and our menu structure for all our products is pretty similar. So on this screen you're seeing a status, uh, it's generating currently, uh, some timestamps and so forth, and then the current power it is doing if I push down, it also cycles through. But if I press enter it opens up the menu, we've got information for basic information, we've got settings for basic settings, we've got advanced information and we've got advanced settings. We're going to go into advanced settings. The code for this is 10, which is 0010, and the fastest way to type that is down, down, up, enter. And we've got a number of uh, advanced settings here. The one that we are interested in today is power control. So I would just press enter on power control. Uh, we've got set output power. We've got set reactive power. So if we wanted to change the power factor of the inverter, we've got output power with restore and we've got reactive power with restore. Now, if we changed set output power, uh, it is percent based. Um, uh, when it resets at the end of the day, when the sun sets, because this, powers, this inverter is powered from the solar, when it turns off, it will forget this value and uh, it will go back to its default. So um, this is not where you would generally change it for um, um, for it to remember it every single day. So if you wanted to remember it and save it in flash to burn it onto the inverter settings, you would essentially go to output P with restore and press enter and then you would change this value. So this is a 10 kilowatt inverter. 100% of 10 kilowatts is 10 kilowatts. If you wanted to derate it to eight kilowatts, uh, you would set that to 80%, essentially. And gradient is, is null, is, is fine, absolutely fine. It's just a function on how quickly it will ramp to that on startup. Um, generally, we don't have to worry about that too much. A status message that often comes up when you change the setting is limp by EPM. Do not worry about that. It essentially just means that it's getting limited by something and the EPM is, is, is primarily the device that limits it, but it, it is absolutely okay. Do not worry about it. It is still injecting its full 240 watts um, and that's all good. Cool. Thank you.